Hello everyone and welcome to oh just okay. Hello everyone and welcome to uh Sunburned Albino plays Mortal Kombat X online for the first time on camera in ever. And uh yeah, I just decided to take the plunge. This is what all the cool kids are doing right now. And even though I wouldn't consider myself an expert, I can hold my own sometimes, depending on what's going on. So let's just do some ranked matches. I'm excited to run into spammers and tournament level players alike, probably both at the same time. Because you know how people who claim to be tournament level players, their strategy revolves around one combo, and then also using that one combo a bunch more times until you die. Which is uh, pretty much that repetition is the definition of spamming, it's just a little more advanced spamming, isn't it? I'm gonna try my very best to not play like that. <clears throat> Uh, as far as my characters go, I've spent a very large amount of time in practice mode with pretty much every character. Uh, that doesn't mean I remember all their combos. It just means that I've got like five or six characters that I can play relatively acceptably well. So, uh, am I gonna remember their fatalities? God, no, I'm not. Those, I can't. There's 20 different, 20 times two different fatalities to remember. Not gonna happen by me. But I will, I have heard of the people who can, like, pause, go to the pause menu and go to the combo list really fast and look at it. And hopefully that can be me. Uh, this has happened the last time. I, w I did share play with somebody and I was trying to do online so they could see what it was all about. And then nobody was playing. So it, uh, it's kind of... Weird, but I'll go into player match. I don't need to be ranked. I don't need to get ranked. I'm not gonna be the guy that's in the bottom left-hand corner. Whatever is number two on the Survivor leaderboard with 500 wins and 22 losses. That is not gonna be me. Okay, yes, let us accept. Madara the God. 55% win odds. I can work with those odds. I won a game where I had 3% win odds, and I'm pretty proud of that. Quan Chi, huh? Uh... <laughs> Why don't we go Kung Lao? I used to think Kung Lao was pretty bad. And he is in terms of his if special moves and like tr doing uh, stuff that does high amounts of damage. But he's so fast and his combos are just pretty, are just really solid that uh, I have been practicing with him more and have found that he is actually not that bad. I don't have a ton of experience fighting Quan Chi though. All right, so let's see how this goes. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so you are you're gonna keep starting with that uh, downwards tilt thing. So uh, I want to try really hard not to just spam ranged attacks from afar. But yeah, you keep you keep doing that goddamn attack. This is what I'm talking about when I say that people have the one combo that they're uh, fluent in. Yeah, there you go. That uppercut's got a longer reach than I would have imagined. Yep, that's helpful. God damn it. Damn it, Quan Chi. Like, when you're playing against people who do, like, the one combo, it's... Okay, you've got armor when you do that. And uh, then it really just like sort of nerfs your options and makes you appear like you're playing really badly. How did you dodge that attack, by the way? God damn it. Yep, there you go. Fine. Fine. Do you know it? You don't know it? I guess not. Uh, 
Every time, man. The problem with Kung Lao One, two, is that three. the combo that I like to do the most that can set me up for like a wide variety of moves is like it starts with his double square attack and that attack has no range at all. Select new fighter. You good with that? Okay. I'm fine with playing against him again. Uh, it, yeah, I can't, so I can never get close enough to actually hit him with it. And so that would be one of Kung Lao's problems. But what about, uh... Let's go Katana, then. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't expect, uh, don't expect to be, like, wowed by my Mortal Kombat prowess here. It's just gonna be... I'm just doing doing this to see how I like it, to see what the response is like. And, uh... Yeah, maybe make it a staple, since pretty much all I have going right now is Bloodborne, besides the occasional one of these. So, uh, yep, okay. Let's try to do a little better this time. Alright. This is not really... We're just trading blocked blows until I don't anymore, so there's that. That is, like, the biggest lag I ever saw in my life. That's not... Obviously, that's not, like... That's not, like, an excuse as to, obviously, why I lost that round, but just that... During the that attack animation was, like, incredibly... Okay, but now there is definitely lag going on here. Okay, there's that. Let's do some... Oh, good that I was able to land that. <sighs> I would have hoped it would have been after that combo, but this works. And then we're gonna follow that up with this, and that's exactly how I predicted it would go. How I hoped it would go. Oh my god, what is lag right now? End it, yeah, ending the game, alright. That counts as a tie though, right? Because I did just win that round. That was like the worst thing. And it's not my connection either. I actually switched uh, online stuff very recently and I've got 100% signal strength now. Uh, Player match? Anybody? Anybody want uh there's a couple characters that if I play against them, I know for a fact I stand no chance. That's Kung Jin, because he's a cheap-ass bitch, and Melina, because everybody who mains Melina is, like, really good with advanced combos. And it really difficult button input, so you got no chance there. Plus, all our combos start with a low attack. Any person whose combo starts with a low attack is going to be a problem, because you already have to adjust for, like, how you... Oh, Madara wants to be friends, that's cool. Um, like how you, just the, your basic block stance. Because if they're gonna do low attacks, then... That's gonna screw things up for you. Gotta keep in mind characters reach with their combo beginnings. And figure out which guys are gonna good counters against other guys. Like, I recently discovered that Devorah is actually a really good counter to Jason. Because all of Jason's good combos and his slasher variation have really low range. So if you counter that with, like, one of Devorah's Ovipositor attacks, uh, they pretty much can't do anything against you there. And Devorah's, like, almost OP, I think, in turn, like, when you use her Venomous variation and just do a ton of those Ovipositor attacks. If you connect enough of them, I know it's obviously very unrealistic that in an online match you'd be able to hit someone, like, nine times in a row with an Ovipositor attack. But the damage tick can get up to, like, 14. Like, the same as an uppercut, so... 
can definitely... 50% win odds, I'll take him. I'll take him. In fact, I've been talking about Devorah, why don't we play as her? I do think that she is pretty good. Oh, alright. I like where this is going. I don't care where we go, I'll just pick whatever yours doing. Do you like my icon? I know it's dedicated to Katana, even though she's not technically my best character anymore. Uh, but it's just because I like the way it looks. I'm going to the Fitzel, and kill your bugs, and then plot them with my own bugs. Ow. Eh. No, you're not better than me. Yeah, yeah. How you like that? I like that. I like the, how that worked out. It obviously wasn't going to work in my favor because I have way less health, but the damage trade there was to my satisfaction. If that appeared to be spam, I apologize. You seem to be very proficient in her combos, and I can't get a hit in edgewise. Like, no matter what I guard, she just follows it up with an even faster attack, and there's nothing to do. Okay, I jumped right on top of it. Okay, Rampage Killer, okay. You got me. But that is something I notice in the matches. Like, for some reason, whenever an enemy is guarding my attack, they have the advantage uh, to, like, do the next attack. But then, if I'm guarding someone else's attack, they still have the advantage to do the next attack. I'm very confused as to how this can be the case. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's too late. Can I still accept that guy's invite? Let me... You're gonna see a blue screen for a bit. Uh... Yeah, join, why not? Connecting to online. It is not, a, it's not available. That is what I thought. Versus, player versus player, player match. Player match is the better place to go if you're looking for people that are going to be at least kind of close to your level. So, uh... Yeah. Also, I refuse to learn Kung Jin because I don't want to be one of those people. So that's just how I feel about that. I did buy Jason, like, yesterday, but I also don't really want to play as Jason... Because, again, he's another one of those, you've got your one or two combos, and you're just going to spam those the whole time. I don't want to be that person. I want to have some variety. I don't know who I'm going to pick, either, is the thing. Let's go, Sonya Blade! Sonya Blade. I like the Disruptor variation the best because of the grenades, obviously. You gonna... gonna pick your character there? Gonna... Gonna pick who you're gonna play there? Just don't be Kung Jin. Just do not be Kung Jin. Do not be Bojutsu, goddammit. And it's everybody... oh my god. Who picks that costume too? This is not gonna work out well for us. He has the range advantage with his staff attacks. He has... Uh, you know, the combo that ends with the jump, or starts with a jump kick and goes into all the other bullshit. 
And it's going to be one of those fights. I don't understand how your attack countered mine. Will you stop doing the one attack, please? I'd really appreciate it. Everybody with Kung Jin is exactly the same. Exactly the same. And it end that a uh, kick ends with a overhead attack. Hey, how about you don't do that? But you got hit by my x-ray. Oh, please do enough damage. Please. Oh, it did. Oh, beautiful. This situation is contained. Final round. Fight. I really don't like that you get armor every time you do that move. Yep, every time you get armor with that move. Stop! Oh my god. Just does the kick. Uh, the kick again, and then after he does the kick, he follows that up with another kick. And then once he's done kicking, he'll end it with another kick. And then after that kick, there's a few more kicks. And then once all the kicks have been done, there is some kicks after that. And then once all the kicks have been done for a second time, you know, just a few more kicks, of course. And the one combo that every single person has. Why not rematch? Why not rematch against Kung Jin, the most bullshit character in the entire world? Yep. Yeah, and that attack has the one low combo that you can't block. And also, why didn't it do the grenade thing? I swear to God. I swear to God, Kung Jin. You make an exceptional punching bag. Round I swear to God, Kung Jin. Damn with the armor! 
Obviously, any combo that starts with a move that can give you armor, you guess who has the advantage? Yes! Yes! <laughs> One combo for me! Hooray! Ah, uh, well, always with the armor. Nope. Oh, it did take all my health. Ah. Uh. What the hell? That seems unlikely. But, uh, whatever. I would enjoy... Uh, the ability to win one match. Like, if I could do that... That would be... Something good for me. Like, just to win. Seems like a stream where you play Mortal Kombat really sort of thrives on the idea that you're actually showing something off, as opposed to dying every single time. No, not test your luck. Player versus player, player match. I'm doing player match on purpose to avoid Kung Jin. Like, I think the game should realize that Kung Jin is for ranked matches only, right? God, at least put me against a Jason. I can at least handle a Jason, a Jason spammer. I can at least do that. Shoot arrows when you're far away as Kung Jin. Do that dumb overhead kick whenever they're blocking low. And then do your stupid little armor attack that launches into a grab. that Or not a grab. That launches into a juggle. That launches into air kicks. That launches into more staff. And you've pretty much got yourself not quite unbeatable since I did win one round. As Sonya Blade of all people. Who is pretty good, honestly, as as, as character Sonya is. But I'm not that good with her. I just try my best, but I swear to god, if you're a Kung Jin, I'm gonna eat somebody's asshole for dinner. And I'm not gonna enjoy that, so it would be a punishment against me. How about we make Kung Lao win one this time? I'd really like that. Come on, Kung Lao, don't fail me! Hopefully the stream is entertaining, at least. Like, even if I can't show off the best combos in the world, even though I know some of them, but can never pull them off when faced with an opponent that can actually move. That's why I spend so much time in practice, because they don't move. Uh, yeah. Are you going to start with the teleport? Yeah, and obviously, you know what online with lag is different than in practice mode. I've got combos with Kung Lao up the ass, but they're not going to work. Uh... Alright, I like that so far. Finally starting to show some good stuff. I think you know what I'm about to start this round off with, that, exactly. Oh, but if you were wondering, uh, no, I'm not gonna let you get over here with that. Okay, you got me with that. Fine, fine, good. Oh my god. Oh, you're a bastard. Lag. You're playing as the one that summons demons? Is that even a good one? I can't. I don't remember. Uh, 
Well, good good attempt there. No, I did it the wrong way. I actually have his memorized, but I forgot what it was. Which makes is kind of the opposite of the intention, clearly. <sighs> Go Kung Lao! Alright, we won one. Oh, we won oh you want a rematch? I'll do it. I will oblige. You can't say it was cheap, I did like every combo he has. I mean, maybe I threw my hat a little too often, but... I'm really trying to avoid. But there are times when it's just best to throw your hat if you're far away. Ah, good one there. God, the lag. The lag. You can see it, right? It's not just me. You know, I was totally about to do that to you, so... Ha-ha! <laughs> it did work! Oh, but is it going to do enough? If not, I have to follow it up with a hat throw. I have to follow it up with a hat throw. Yeah! Oh, that is good. Oh, the overhead attack trumps the, the slide. I keep trying to do the hat throw after that attack, but it, the lag is not... There we go. Okay, this time I got it right. Nope. There we go, yes. All right, gory. I feel good about my performance in that one. At least a little bit. <sighs> okay, yeah, that's good for me. That is good for me. Good for business. And that's going to do it for this stream. Just a test stream to see if people want to see more of this. If, I, if it would behoove me to practice a bit more and become someone that is actually relatively adept. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and whatnot, and uh, I will see you guys next time.